since you got in into the Senate, what should you say is your success? As a, because I actually saw the ratings as well. Mm. You're rated among as the most um, vocal, hardworking. Of course, uh, you've really made sure you've brought um, uh, uh, bills and motions on the table. Yes. What 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 is your success now? What is your success as Mushimia Uh It's just first of all, it's just uh, the fact that God has given me this opportunity is one mm. of my greatest fulfillments. Mm. Uh, secondly, it's how I've been able to connect with the people. Mm -hmm. It's something that I treasure so much. Words mm -hmm. cannot explain. Mm -hmm. Because whichever kada, me for me, it doesn't matter whatever level. Mm. I'm, I'm able to interact with anyone. Mm. And that gives me, you know, a lot of satisfaction and fulfillment. Mm. Even at this level, it, it, it doesn't matter. Beautiful. Uh, what I pride in uh, is that I've been able to understand what is the role of a senator. Mm. When I came in, I was new, mm. and I always believe that each day is a learning day. And I've been able to learn the, the processes and everything. Oh, literally. And uh, further to that, personally, I've been able to do bills. One of the bills is in regards to agricultural extension, whereby each and every county will have the officers that will be able to oversee the agricultural nice, sector. Nice, nice. The other one is the Labor uh, Immigration Management Bill. He mm. bill, ni ile bill inatach ya na wasichana wetu, watoto wetu, mm. wenye wanaenda inchi za inje kufanya kazi yeah. diaspora. Mm. Saudi Arabia, Gulf, and all that. Because Kitambo, there's a, some girls I actually helped. And I prayed to God one day, akini pata chance ya kweza kufika bunge, mm. neza push the bill. And I'm happy because the bill is actually at public participation. Oh, nice one. Nice. Uh, I think for me, for me, that is that is really what touches my heart. Kimbe kimi tarisha zawadi ya as we as we finish. Yeah. Um, and the, what is what, in just one statement? Yes. What is your what is your what is what is going to be your biggest objective as a leader? What do you want to be remembered for as a leader? We just want to go and give to Yes. As we finish up. Yes, I want to be remembered in regards to having supported mm. uh, this uh, labor movement, this mm. uh, our, our immigrant workers, mm. and at the same time, what I normally call workers and a mama mm. is is um, a sector for all women as long as you're. A, a uh, woman, it doesn't matter the age, and you have a space that you can be able to, to grow. Beautiful. At times, it's not about the money. It's not the monetary. Mm. At times, our young people just need someone who can just even just give them an ear and listen to them. Nice. Because we tend to create platforms of like who's shouting the most, who has, you know, but you're not really listening to what they are bringing out. And that's why even when the other day Gen Z's were in the streets, yes. and I keenly took my time, I said, by the way, I'm proud of our generation. Mm. Our, our, you know, our education system, because our women are here, but if you are here, you are engaged, you have a point. What is your point? So you are going to do that? That is your objective? We are doing that. Beautiful. So.